Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a working mom morning routine, working from home morning routine, what my mornings look like. Now that I am remotely working and I have the kids home, so I get up right around six in the morning and then from there I just throw my hair up in a bun um, and then Kaya usually grabs Riker out of his bed. Um, I had pulled off his sheet because he had peed through his um, last sheet in the middle of the night. I think it's time to move him up in diapers. Um, and then I get the shower going and I start a show for the kids in my bedroom. Um, I was in desperate need of a shower this morning and while I showered, the kids destroyed the bedroom. Destroyed the bedroom. Do you see that laundry? Yeah. So, um, and then I go in with a, um, this is actually a sleeping mask, a hydration mask, and my skin has just been really dry lately. So I figured I would put it on my face and let it sit for the day today. Um, and just wanted to mention to you guys too, that I did record this on a Monday morning. Um, I usually have Mondays off. I did work a little bit on this particular Monday just so I, so I could show you guys what my mornings look like when I am working. Um, I actually typically get up like at 6 and then go straight downstairs and work from like 6 to 8.30 um, so that I can get some working time in before the kids wake up. So the kids usually wake up any time between like 7.30 and 8.30 and those morning, those early, early morning hours are my golden time to get things done. So I'll usually push myself to get up right around 6. Um, as you guys can see here, this is like my house robe. I got it from Target. It's my favorite. Um, and then I also used a little bit of this like flirt um, like body oil. My sister-in-law gave it to me for Christmas. I'm hollering for Kaya in this clip. Kaya's been on like a running away spree. It's really actually pretty terrifying. Um, and then I grabbed the kids' outfits and I showed you guys what deodorant I'm currently using. Um, it's by Native and I do really like it. Um, and my little shadow here, oh my gosh, he's my favorite. He's so sweet in the morning. He's so snuggly and he's totally a mama's boy. But I will bring Riker downstairs and then I will change his bum. Um, and then after I'm done changing his bum, it's usually when I will start breakfast. So then I go ahead and make my iced coffee. You guys have seen me make this in many, many videos. It's my favorite. I use um, espresso powder. It's like by Gavalia, Gavalia, something. Um, I honestly just get it from Walmart. I have Walmart delivery for groceries. So that's the espresso powder that they have on hand. So that's what I order. Um, and then I go ahead and brew my coffee over ice and I add more ice to it once it's done too. And then pour in some half and half. Um, and then I go ahead and I open up the blinds just to get some natural light in, especially when I'm working from home. I just get in a funk if it's like too dark throughout the day um, and it's been so nice out. Um, Riker is, like I said, my little buddy. He always snuggles with me, wants to sit with me. So usually while breakfast is cooking um, or I'm letting my coffee brew or whatever it is, um, he will snuggle with me for a little bit in the morning. It's so sweet and probably one of my favorite things about the morning um, is that he's just so sweet and snuggly. But anyhow, and then I'm just showing here that I usually run up and down the stairs like 50 times because the kids can take the gate down and it's awesome. So just putting that gate back up, putting the kids um, into the um, living room and setting them up with a show. Kaya has been on a kick with Dino Dana lately. So lots of dinosaur sounds in the background while I'm working. Um, I don't mind dinosaur shows, I love them, but um, we've been literally watching Dino Dana on repeat for like three days and yeah, it's, uh, it's getting to be a little much, but that's okay. Um, and then I put Riker in his high chair and then I'll cut up some fruit. I've got some fresh oranges and apples on hand right now. So that is what they're getting for um, their fresh fruit with their breakfast on this particular morning. And then after I get Riker his oranges, I will set myself up with some emergency. Um, and then I also take my vitamin. I still take a multivitamin just because that's what I've always taken, you know, being pregnant or 
um, breastfeeding. It's just it's just a great vitamin. I really love it. Um, I usually get it from Costco. I think you can even get it from like Target, Walmart. I usually get like the bigger bottle from Costco. Um, and then I made the kids eggs this morning. Um, like I said, this was actually on a Monday when I usually typically have Mondays off, so I had a little bit more time. But um, if it's a busier morning, I will just do <laughs> cereal or oatmeal or something super easy. Um, Riker didn't want half of his toast, so I ended up having um, one and a half slices of toast for breakfast this morning. Um, I have oranges as well and two eggs. Kaya likes cream cheese on her toast. I don't know if you guys saw that in the last clip. but um, And then she ate two eggs and wanted more. So here I'm going back and I'm making her another egg because as a mom, that's all you are. You're just the food and snack maker. I'm just kidding, but that's what it feels like most days. So here I'm just making her an extra egg. Um, and then I will um, usually get Riker dressed for the day. While Kaya's finishing up her breakfast, you can totally see underneath my couch here too. I didn't realize how dusty it was until um, this footage. I feel like I'm constantly sweeping and vacuuming, which by the way, my Dyson broke. So we're waiting on a replacement park for that. Everything's breaking, it's super awesome. Um, here's Riker um, doing his chores. I'm just kidding. He has been like carrying around the brooms lately and like his toy room and it's so cute. He's like a little cinder Riker. Um, anyway, and then I go in and um, rinse off his tray, brush his hair, I get his sister ready, um, and then I brush her hair. So that's what you guys see me doing here is just getting the kids ready. Oh, and he's going to brush my hair. He's going to help me. He's such a good little helper. He's just a, he's just a mama's boy. Look at him. He's just so sweet. So for Kaya's hair, I have been uh, braiding her hair quite a bit lately. She had a little bit of a, like, a cutting the hair incident a while back. So that's why her she's got like bangs and she hates having her hair done. I don't know about you guys, but like it's, it's so impossible to get Kaya to sit still to have her hair done. So I just do like a really quick braid. She usually cries through the whole thing anyways. And then I get her to give her a kiss afterwards um, because I know I hated having my hair done when I was... Um, a little girl, so I, I totally feel her pain, but I have to get that hair pulled out of her face, um, and she also likes to chew on her hair, so, um, and then after I get Kaya ready, now this is where I really need to get some work done, so I start setting the kids up for the day. This is one of the most important things that I do in my morning, is getting the kids set up. Riker, I put him in his playpen. Kaya usually likes to hop in with him for a little bit, but I'll set Riker up in his playpen with some toys that'll keep him occupied for a while. Again, we've got Dino Dana on, of course. Um, and then after I've got Riker set up, I'll go and set up Kaya. Um, here she's gonna be working on letters this morning. So I am just getting out her workbook um, and then I clean up my breakfast spot and then usually sit down and try to get like a good 45 minutes in of work before I have to um, either get the kids a bottle or whatever it may be. So. Typically my schedule, I will work in two hour increments. So that's about as long as I can with the kids is two hours. And then I'll usually take like a 15 minute break, interact with them, hug them, love them, um, and help them with whatever they may need. Um, Kaya again has been working on letters. She's just been so good. Sorry, I got Riker in the background. Um, but she's just been so good at like practicing her letters. We've been having like circle time in the morning, learning about the day of the week and the month. Um, here I caught them snuggling. They of course stopped as soon as I pulled the camera out, but it was so sweet. Um, and then right around 10, 1030 is when Riker goes down for his morning nap. So once he goes down for his nap, that's when mama really gets stuff done. Um, so that's what you see here is I am going in and getting my work done for the day. He'll usually sleep till about 1.30 or so. All right, you guys, that is going to wrap it up for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this morning routine, um, working from home with the kids. Um, both kids are four and under. One is four, one is one, um, and it has been a challenge. So all of my love um, and sane thoughts going out to you mamas out there with kids at home and also working, I totally feel for you. 
All right, you guys, if you like this video, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed to my channel down below so that you don't miss out on any of my other future videos. I've got lots of fun DIYs and quarantine isolation videos coming out for you guys. And I will see you in a couple days for an organized and clean video. All right, you guys, I'll see you later.